Hey everybody. Hello everybody. Hey everybody. It's Brock. This is Brock. And we got a new episode with another episode of All About. Of All About. All About. What's up everybody? We got a new episode of All About today. You were here with Brock and we are learning about the lime green mantis shrimp. You can basically use this video to learn about any mantis shrimp you might think about getting. Prices on them, you'll spend about 20 bucks. Tank size, doesn't matter. Care level, they're super easy to take care of. Temper, but they are very, very aggressive. Reef compatible, you could put one in a reef tank. Temperature, keep it 72 to 78. DKH, 8 to 12. pH, 8.1 8.4. And your salinity, 1.023 to 1.025. It's very specific. Diet, they are carnivore. They eat anything that comes near them. Uh, they use that hard clapping from their quick claws to be used to break shells of hermit crabs which is very deadly and you can even hear it from outside the tank you should definitely look up some videos on it it's crazy max size they can get is a four inches that's pretty big for a little mana shrimp compatibility you know just ask you can have multiples in a tank if you wanted colors is that green you see origin they do come from indo-pacific so if you want my opinion short and simple do not get one of these guys you do not want him he's basically a pest they will kill smaller fish and i've seen him kill pretty large fish too with him in people's tanks like i've seen him kill a nice size yellow tang it was bad <laughs> but uh we have kept them in coral only tanks a lot of people just love mana shrimps and if you love them just do the right thing put them in a coral only tank they do fine in those you rarely see them uh the ones we've had i've never seen them before the only reason we caught this one is because he was hanging up by the filter so we figured we'd take our chance and that's the only reason i got this video is because he's sitting in the bag uh other than that you really don't want this guy he's super mean Normally, a lot of times, whenever people end up with them, it's because they bought a live rock and he was actually in there. And then their fish start dying and they're like, what the heck's happening? And then they find this guy in there wrecking havoc on everything. But if you are a mana shrimp kind of person, you definitely should get one. They're really cool to watch. They're very pretty, very unique looking if you see them out. But he is he's a killer, so I definitely wouldn't recommend him. Hope y'all have a good day. This video was short and simple. He's a real easy crustacean to take care of, but not one I recommend. I will see y'all later. Make sure to like and subscribe. Check out my other videos, and I just hope y'all are having a great summer. I'll see y'all later. We just hit a thousand subscribers. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all. I can't thank y'all enough from that. All started out with me just working in the fish store with an idea to let everyone know how to take care of some fish and here we are a thousand deep and it feels great so to celebrate for the whole month of june every single day i'm gonna put out a new episode of all about about some kind of fish some kind of crustacean maybe different things on how to take care of stuff but just either way every single day you're going to be getting a video from me and it's going to be awesome maybe even more videos so here we go, stay tuned. Here comes celebrating a thousand subscribers.